Hello and welcome. This is Diego St. John coming to you live and direct and in full effects. All right, let me tell you what's going on here. So it is the end of the month of February. And what is going on, hedge funds did not cover their shorts throughout the month of February. Okay? You have, or they have to, hedge funds, cover twice a month. So yesterday, which was Wednesday, first day of covering. Tomorrow, today will be the next day of covering. You see everyone's up in the pre-market. So they're going to let it run. It's going to run a day. Okay, but here's the thing. Let's go to the calendar, right? You go to the calendar. You see that Monday is March 1st. March 1st, they will be shorting the hell out of all these stocks. They're going to start on Friday at the peak of Friday. Get all the money you can on Thursday. Be careful on Friday. You know what I'm saying? If you have strong diamond hands, leave those strong diamond hands positions. But if you are in options, you know what I'm saying? You got to play smart. So they're definitely going to be shortening the fuck out of it starting March 1st. Okay? And they probably won't cover all the way until March 31st. So that gives them how many weeks? One, two, three, four weeks of shorting a stock. Doom, 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 doom. Watch out for the market crash March 1st through the 22nd. And then to get paid again Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Okay? Uh, the 29th, the 30th, and the 31st when they're going to be covering again but as long as you um don't sell the shares hold the shares and and have long positions and options you hold 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 because you own the shares and they have to by law pay you the covering so and you demand what you gonna cost? The man of you wanting is how you demand a thousand dollars is no one sells and everybody holds until a thousand dollars, right? That and they they don't think everyone's gonna hold. Okay, just being honest with you. So in small fish, little money, you don't have to hold. You know what I'm saying? Your 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 percentiles doesn't matter. You're like Dodge coin right now when when it was less than a cent. You know what I'm saying? Like you're that. Compare it to Bitcoin, which is the head funds and the government and everybody who's against us, the millions and billions and trillions of dollars. Okay, you, you get where I'm coming at there on that. So they're doing this shit in cycles, and I don't know when it's gonna change. You know what I'm saying? I don't. I stopped making as many videos because I feel like they watch all the videos, and then it, you know it was like going against me. I lost a lot of money. So. Um, I was just like, hey, I just, you know, felt like there was a reason why, and that's the only thing I could think of. But it's more or less me and my own choices, uh, and, 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 and just screwing myself. Now, there are rules to this game, and please stick to them, okay? The best rules for me, not right now in this Wall Street bets, because this is, a, we're short squeezing, right? On all these positions, they're all short squeeze. Anyways, so... And you want to get the ones that have, I'll show you. So look here at the free free float. Okay, in the free float market cap. There's 203 million shares available. There's 62 million shares left, right? That's why they're not taking off. But let me show you why GameStop is. Okay? GameStop is taking off because the free float is 54 million. But out of five, I mean, well, not five billion, almost five billion, four point nine seven billion. Okay, and when you do those numbers, that's a very low free float. So it's like cost and demand, like price and demand. You know what I'm saying? Like the demand is definitely pushing up the price. So Sundown, they have one point five billion free float. Whoa. Gotta. 
Anyways, uh, I lost a lot of money <laughs> with those guys. Uh, costs. This one right here, 845K free, free, free float. A free float market cap of 15.59 million. Let's go. I'm jumping in on option plays on this today because the, the free float is so small and um so so this is what happened so at 4 a.m let me show you guys 4 a.m market's gonna go up doom, and it's gonna start going down and it could continue going down all the way until you know 9 a.m so i don't like to really buy 4 a.m unless i got to buy in down here right let's see hit one day See, it was down there at 25, right? 25, 26. Give me a 27 and I'm buying in, right? Bam. At 7 o'clock, it might jump up, though. Because all the uh, buyers coming in from Fidelity and everywhere else. So, 7 a.m., man, this thing's going to take off. And I'm waiting because I'm going to do the option plays on it. So I have $1,000 on AMC um, with like 130-something shares. And um, I'm, I'm up. I'm up with them. And I have uh, like an average share is like around 740-something, 745, something like that. Um, I kicked myself in the balls there too because I was in at 558 and then sold, um, thinking it was going to drop back down, but it didn't drop back. Well, I sold actually, so I got it at 558, sold at like 650, was waiting for the dip, didn't dip, got back in. Uh, uh, well, it did dip, but I didn't get back in until six, what was it like? It was, I don't know, six, six something. And then it ran up to over seven. Then I sold. And then I was waiting for the next dip because normally it did dip. But man, everybody was just buying so much. I didn't get in on time. I thought the nine, 930, well, 940 dip happened at like 935. And I thought it was going to dip more. So that's like this morning when this thing's open. I'll probably dip at like 935. You know what I'm saying? Not maybe not even you know we'll see what you know I'm guessing 9:35, 9:40 will be the dip, and boo they're gonna take off, they're gonna rip. So try to get the best price on the um, options you can in the morning on the morning dip, and then um, if it flies up and you make a bunch of money, sell. I don't give a fudge sickle people. P play it smart with your options, okay? I've lost a bunch of money. You hold your shares, buy shares and hold shares. I had that with AMC, but with options and sell your options and make your money. You know what I'm saying? Use your three day trades if you got to, if you have a 25K in the account. All right, guys. Talk to you later. Peace.